Hello and welcome to a, another Ginger Mathematician video, a slightly different kind of video today where I'm going to do some Q&A, some question and answer on IGCSE A-Level and IB Maths. Right, let's get started with your questions. So the first one here from Not Protoon Noob123 is do some differentiation, mensuration and percentage tips. Uh, I've certainly done all these different topics, so I've certainly done these in detail. What I haven't done is actual a tips video. So I just want to clarify, are you looking for an IGCSE, say, differentiation tips or maybe the key knowledge you need to answer those kind of questions. Again, do let me know in the comments below. Never thought about doing a tip video for a topic, but there's no reason why not. On to our next question here. So how to revise every topic and solve hard questions. So I'm going to break this down into two parts here. So revising every topic, the very best thing that you can do is using the IGCSE Maths playlist. So this is a playlist that if you go down into the description, you'll find the link there. And I think there is 160 videos on IGCSE Maths. Now that goes from topic breakdowns to prediction videos to trigger words to look out for and everything else in between. So if you're looking for that revision of every single topic, that is the place to go. If we take with solve hard questions, well, I've recently launched a course on Udemy, and that is called IGCSC Maths Hard Questions. Again, I'll put a link in the description. So if you're interested in that course that goes through the very hardest questions from 0580, uh, then by all means, please have a look at that course. On to the next question. So can I please list out all the possible topics for paper two and four? Well, I have done that in my prediction videos. So that's one that came out fairly recently. So my IGCSE predictions, and that is for May 2024. And what I go through in that particular video, and I'll leave a link in the description as well, but essentially the frequency of topics. So for example, probability more or less on both papers comes up 100% of the time. So if I said to revise any topic from the course, probability is probably, shouldn't use the word probably, the one to go for. And that'd be of great help. That's good to hear. Uh, mock exam today and did well. That's fantastic to hear. And no, yeah, no problem doing those tutorial videos. I'm glad I can help you with your revision process. On to the next one here, Investor Center uh, ZT6GH. So hi, Ginger, could you please do a video on IGCC percentages slash ratios? Now percentages is already in that playlist that I mentioned already. Ratios, however, is not a one I have done so far. So I'll definitely add that to my list, IGCSC ratio. Again, I focus on those number style questions that come up usually at the start of a paper four and like really hard questions, not a problem. I will certainly start working on that. On to here, so I feel like circle geometry is one of the hardest subjects for me to tackle. If you could please do a video on it, that would be highly appreciated. Now, when you're saying circle geometry, uh, again, we can break that down into circle theorems. So I've done an all of a circle theorems video that might be useful to you, but I haven't really done a video on circles per se. So looking at say area of 2D shapes, like with parts of circles or sectors of circles. So that's something I will add to my list. And then once it's finished, of course, it'll be on the channel and go into that IGCSE Maths playlist. On to this comment here. So please cover the space physics type math questions that came out in the October, November papers. I'm not entirely sure what questions you mean here. This could be uh, from using standard form, like working out the distances of planets, that kind of stuff. This could be speed time graphs which often comes up as well, which could be classified in this kind of physics type question as well. So again, let me know in the comments what kind of questions you're looking at. Maybe give me a particular question number from the November 2023 papers, and I'll look into it for you as well. And is mechanics on your list? So now we're talking about A-level maps here. So Nabil Ahmed is asking about A-level mechanics. Will I be looking into that and will I branch out into other things? Well, I do have um, fit mechanics ready, basically. So if we take uh, statics, for example, so the forces affecting a stationary particle, I do essentially have all the resources ready. It's a case of having the time to film. Um, I've been looking at statistics mostly, so that's paper five. But I understand paper four is also 
quite sought after as well. So I'm more than happy to go through all kinds of mechanics topics as well. But again, it's just time at this point and trying to fit everything in. But thank you for your comment. Again, it's definitely on the radar. How quickly I can work on that, again, we'll see in the months and years to come. Uh, next one is rates of change, which I literally just did a video of. This is A-level maths. So if you look at the related rates of change video that came out last week, again, I've been through that. Uh, normal distribution for S1, <coughs> so statistics one or paper five, as it's also known as well. Um, I'm certainly working on an all of A-level maths paper five video, which goes through all the statistics topics. You know, about halfway through that at the moment. I still need to finish off um, probably distribution tables, normal distribution, things like this. But I'm certainly working on that at the moment and we'll see how far we get in the months to come. And would really appreciate if you could do past paper questions uh, for IGCC before April, before the exam stuff on differentiation, graph of a function and probability. I have already done videos on those topics. Again, I'll put that in the description, not a problem. Um, maybe we can look at a sort of 2022 style video where we look at some more up to date questions. I think the probability one is about three years old, give or take. So certainly we could look at an updated probability uh, video, especially as it's one of the really key topics in IGCSE. OK, and if you've got any more questions for me, then please let me know in the comments below. I'm happy to do another video like this and answer your vital questions for your revision for IGCSE A-level and IB maths. And if you're looking to revise your IGCSE maths, the first video you should look at is the one right in front of you where I go through as much as I can over two hours to make sure you're ready for both paper two and paper four.